Hi there, my name is John from Toby Dynavox and I'm here today to talk to you about the powerful Dwell Free Keyboard, which is a feature of Communicator 5. The Dwell Free Keyboard can really help with reducing effort and improving typing speed for AEC users who are using keyboard to either uh, speak messages or type text into other applications such as text messaging or Skype. It works by moving away from the traditional dwell method of selection, which can slow users down because uh, your speed is very much determined by your dwell selection time. So if you have a dwell selection time of one second, you can't write a word such as hello with five letters any quicker than five seconds, unless of course it appears on the prediction list. Um, the way that Dwell Free works is by only requiring you to glance at le letters and then using clever algorithms to work out what you'd intended to write. The best way of explaining this, though, is through a demonstration. So I'm going to go to my screen now and use my eye gaze system to call up my speak keyboard. Uh, this is the Dwell Free keyboard you'll see here, and I'm going to write you a short message. Hopefully it's written my, hello, my name is John. Okay. You would have seen as I was using that, uh, certain letters were lighting up in, bl in blue as I go. Um, it, this gives me a general indication that I'm looking in the right area. However, if the wrong letter is lighting up, you shouldn't uh, go over it again or try to correct it because the algorithms will hopefully sort that out for you. I'm going to uh, write a little bit more. So hopefully I wrote, I'm using my eyes to type. Okay, so you'll see it's made an error there. It's put to there instead of to type. This is a good opportunity to show you the correction facility. So I can look at the um, the options up at the top and you'll see I've got, I'm using my eyes to there, I'm using my eye to type or I'm using my eyes to type. I can either make that selection from there and that will correct it for me as you can see or I could have corrected the individual word by looking at the ABC and then choosing the word that was needed to be corrected and then uh, basically typing with a, a dwell method however everything's correct now so I can look at the tick at the top Okay, if I do ever need to switch to a, dwe a standard dwell keyboard uh, during whatever I'm writing, I just look at this symbol at the bottom, it switches to a dwell keyboard. I'm going to write the word hello. Um, I was able to type it with uh, accuracy, but I'm tr I'll trust that you can see that uh, it was going to be much slower. Okay. So that's the Dwell Free Keyboard. Say it quicker with Communicator 5.